this is this is a mess. Okay, 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 okay. Hey kid, hey kid. Yeah, like, give me a thing. Yo, sassy. Yes, I know it's wonky. Yes, I know. Hello, hello. Alright, this should be okay now. Little hop. Yes, yes, yes. Press shift tab to close this message. Shift tab indeed. Hello? I said shift tab, you- oh, you made it worse. There we go. Uh, I'm kind of playing alone. Does this thing have controller support? It, it do! Ooh. It do have support. Okay. I am doing this by myself! All right, for full disclosure, I'm not going into this blind, but it's been so long since I've watched a playthrough of people doing this that I no longer remember. <laughs> Point and click controls. Fucking decoding errors, God damn it! It's okay, I'm just davening over which control scheme I want to use. Roadside Diner, 19... Nope. 942 p.m. present day. Yo, Chaos. What's up, dude? Sorry, I know you were streaming earlier today. I'm gonna have to watch the VOD. I was shoveling for most of the day. And working for the rest. For some reason, I'm getting, um... Oh god, what's that movie? Silent Hill. Y you attempted. Yeah, someone hit your pole again. That happens way too often. Thanks for pulling over. Sure. Something wrong? Yeah, there are no subtitles. All. Yes. We got a problem up ahead. A big accident. We've had to close the road. Right. We're diverting all traffic through Little Hope. You okay, buddy? You seem a little confused. Yeah, I'm fine. 
I just want to get these folks to where they need to be. I doubt a short delay will trouble them too much. Head up the East Road. Takes you straight through Little Hope. Adds almost no time to your journey. I'm gonna try not to spoil. Oh god, I see bridges like that and I feel like um, those bandits from RDR2 are gonna attack me on either side of them. God, that's another game I missed. I gotta play more of that. And cyberpunk. <laughs> You rub that chip any harder, it'll wear away to nothing. What? How long have you been sober? It's shy of three months. Impressive. I heard the first 90 days are the toughest and roughest. Well, I know it doesn't add up, but I get something from holding on to this. We're going the wrong way. It's fine, just a quick detour. It's not fine. Calm down. It's all okay. Oh, please, John, could you not patronize me? Can you keep it down, please? <laughs> Bearing updated. Interesting. Yes, little run. Stop it, Jane. You know I hate it when you don't take the things I say seriously. Come on, sweetheart, I do. I just had a rough day today. Can you believe they are at each other again? I can. You're drunk. What a surprise. I just caught the game with the guys, honey. That's it. That's not it. Never is. There's talk. Some of us may be losing our jobs. The factory... You've been saying that for years. I'm more worried about Megan. What's wrong with Megan? She looks okay to me. Everything looks okay after 10 beers. Reverend Carson held her back after prayers today. That's four weeks running. She's not right. It's serious, James. You worry too much about that kid. I can't deal with this right now. Another surprise. You can't deal with anything. When would be the right time? You're making a mountain out of a molehill. Getting yourself worked up for nothing. For nothing? Single-handedly keeping our family together Sam. is far from nothing in my book. I just book. put up a sign that I says slow the fuck down. You're sick and tired of losing power. I approve. Would be happening. That's a real low blow. Don't you get how tough this is You're not is the only me? one feels pressure. The factory situation is serious, Anne. Real serious. Not right now. <laughs> These guys don't know how to handle crises together. Not tonight. No way. This is this is just a crazy household situation. Tanya's late. She always is these days. Tanya? It's Tanya. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna not say much. Why is this here? Only released last year. Even a no-taste hardhead like you will appreciate this. Going to be huge. <clears throat> I hope you're doing okay, kid. Hey, Bigfoot, mind the goddamn vinyl, will ya? I've seen it and spoiled, spelled Tonya and Tanya. Tonya? Uh, it was There's an no accident. need to be so tough on her. It was an accident. Everything Megan does is an accident. What the fuck? I still don't understand why they're so hard on her. But it's never Tanya. It's Clarice. 
I'm going to start climbing through the window unless that door gets fixed. How's things? Let me guess. He's been pumping iron again? They've been at each other's throats since Dad got home. What's it about this time? Uh, Dad's been the drinking. Point. Who could have guessed it? They're always fighting these days, getting predictable, like a record that keeps playing over and over. It's the 80s, Dennis, Bible thumbs and family, nothing surprises time, me. Will you ship yeah, that shit of yours up into the attic? Some respect. This is a valuable, rare, and sought after collection. <laughs> I think she was a marine sergeant of past life. <laughs> What's crawled up his ass? <laughs> Sorry, that's just funny. Uh, uh, Dennis is being Dennis. Dennis doing what he's good at. Being really Dennis. What a surprise. Hey, Dennis. Oh boy. Hey. Not now, sis. I'm busy. Uh. <gasps> oh. Hey. Quit acting crazy. <laughs> Girl, you got to get louder footsteps. Jesus. You scared me, sweetheart. I heard you talking about me. Not now, Megan. I'd like to have a bath in peace. Take a break from this madhouse for a while. Okay, 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 okay. Gotta put a bell on her. I mean, okay, thing one. Yeah, Megan and I have that in common. I scare the shit out of people in my family because I walk too quietly and then they turn around and I'm there and they friggin' have a heart attack. I think dad almost hit me a couple times because, like, I kind of just appear and he was just like, what the fuck was that? And then he says, like, oh, be louder. And I'm like, got it. Um, thing one. Thing two. If your kid is having trouble... She's, she's saying, oh, I'm so worried about Megan, I'm so worried about Megan, blah, 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 blah. Why then would you not sit down and have a conversation with Megan? Instead, you're like, no, 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 I'm gonna take a hot bath as though that can't wait. Like. I don't know, maybe I'm spoiled. Like. Maybe I'm spoiled, but, like, mom would never close the door in my face. Not my mom. My mom tends to have the opposite problem. She keeps opening doors. Um, but <laughs> it's so much better than that. Like, I don't know. Maybe I just have really good parents, so, like, I don't get this. But, like, if your kid is having issues, wouldn't it make more sense to spend more time with her, try to figure out what's going on in her head? Like, still real salty about Clarice? Same. Like, I don't know, ma'am. Like, is, is, am I... Am I out of touch? <laughs> is is this normal parenting? I don't know. I I don't know. Also, her face is straight in the uncanny valley. Maybe you should talk to mom and dad. It's not a great idea for me to get involved. You know what I'm like? I just upset someone. This sounded more serious than the usual bullshit. 
They were talking about Megan. She's done something bad. I can't say I'm surprised. There's definitely something off with Megan. I don't get why everyone keeps picking on her. Okay, Mr. Shining Knight in Armor. Where's the little princess anyway? What? 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 Everyone keeps picking on her. She did something bad. This is a kid who's struggling with something. Why is everyone being like, ugh, what a fucking devil? Like, the fish in the vanilla and the in the vanilla. Like, <laughs> This annoys me. This annoys me. I feel like people underestimate how difficult it is to raise foster kids from the looks of it. Papa Dearest doesn't do shit to help Mumsy wanting alone time, so I don't feel so wrong. Oh, so Mumsy wanting alone time, I don't feel so wrong. Okay, yeah, wanting alone time is one thing. But, like, if you've just had a conversation with a child and they overheard what they what was said about them, I feel like that's an important time to have a chat. The way she approached it wasn't right, but I understand the idea. I mean, yeah, like, everyone needs a break at some point. When I was growing up, it was soap operas. Mom would have, like, soap opera time where she would sit down, she'd have her coffee, she'd have her snack time, and she'd watch, like, soaps for an hour. We would do homework, and, like, we would just let her chill. Um... And, you know, she, she'd she come home from a day of work. She was an optometrist. She was practicing then. And, like, she'd come home. She'd help us with her homework. Da, 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 da. Make sure, like, dinner was all set up and whatever. And then, like, she got her time. And that was understood by all of us. Like, that was reasonable. Like, like yeah, that makes sense. Like, we just knew, like, if something was like wrong and out of the ordinary we can come over and like be like yo mom like it wasn't like it was sacrosanct in in such a way that we couldn't ask for help if we needed it but like we kind of understood that mom needed her time to chill um and she made that clear to us and we understood it but like actually what ended up happening was as we got older um we started also watching the soap operas because like it was moving pictures on the screen and it was more entertaining than like 2x plus 3x equals what so like i get that but if a kid is in obvious distress i don't know do you think it's a good idea for the conversation to take place when she's already frustrated and angry? Okay, that that is a good point. I've always been told to take a step back and calm down before discussion. Okay, no, no, no. Yeah, no, you're right, you're right, you're right. You're right. You're right. If, if she's frustrated and angry, then that's not the time to... to chat. But even... I guess this is where, like, a bit of the wren comes out, because we don't gotta get into why Ren is the way Ren is but like even something as simple of hey honey I love you I'm overwhelmed I need to like decompress like you could just be transparent and I don't know maybe it's just the way I was brought up but like you were absolutely right it is better to have a conversation that high stakes when when your brain is clearer at the same time like uh it it's rough because i don't know exactly what the kid is going through but the kid is definitely going through something and i i don't think people are getting the picture that like well maybe mom does but like everyone else is just like ugh, the kid is always doing wrong shit like So, all right, all right, all right. Let's here. You wanna you wanna have some deep wolfy lore? Here's some here's some deep wolfy lore. So, when I was little, I had something called sensory integration disorder. Um, apparently, my brain wasn't braining correctly, 
and I just experienced the world in a apparently a very different way than everyone else was experiencing the world. Um, and socially and with a lot of things, I was kind of on a different rhythm than everybody else. Um, which is not to say I was a, a special little snowflake. I was a pain in the ass. Um, and I didn't mean to be a pain in the ass. I just kind of was because I, I guess I was just running a different OS than everybody else. And what I thought made sense didn't make sense to everyone else and vice versa. Um, and... Like, don't get me wrong, my parents were, and still are, super great and attentive and supportive. Um, but I was a really tough kid uh, to raise. I had a lot of issues. Um, and I grew up acutely aware that I had a lot of issues and that a lot of what I was perceiving and going through was wrong or not normal or not the way I was supposed to be doing things. And I guess little kid me internalized that to the point where I was just like, oh, okay, I'm just fucked up and everything I do is fucked up. And, well, fucked up wasn't the word I used back then. The word back then that I was thinking was wrong. Um, and somehow fucked up seems more gentle than wrong. Um, but the word was wrong. And... Only until fairly recently, which is... I wouldn't say super deep in my adult life, but we're, we're pretty solidly adult now. Only fairly recently have I stopped assuming that everything I do and everything I think and everything I say is default wrong. Because for most of my 25 years, I'm pretty sure I just kind of assumed, yeah, everything I'm doing is wrong. Um... And that's no one's fault, but that's not great. And... Maybe it would have helped to be like, hey, we understand you're not trying to be a pain, but like, we don't know what to do. I don't know, maybe I'm just too sensitive fucking <laughs> but like you could at least not demonize the kid you know like uh, god I'm doing more pontificating than I am playing the game but like I I, I had to talk about that because I'm just, like what the fuck like if, if a kid is acting like that in fact, if a kid is acting any such way where they're doing things you wouldn't expect them to do or their behavior is, like, off in some way, like, even if their behavior is problematic, like, talk to them. <laughs> Ask them why they do the things they do. Like, have some compassion. Like, And some kids are just straight evil. Like, there are some people and some kids who are just straight evil. But most of the time, they're acting out because something's not right. And they don't know how to do things because they're brand new to the world. And, like, they're still figuring it out. Fuck, we're adults and we're still figuring out our shit. So, like, I don't know. I, I wish they wouldn't demonize the poor little kid. I guess I guess I see Ren in 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 that situation and it, it like hurts a little. I don't know. Like uh, 
And it's not necessarily anyone's fault. It's just sad. Uh, concerned? Probably better to leave Megan alone. As her big sister, it is my sworn legal duty to check in on her. Right, sure. Like you're the law around here. Oh, God. She went upstairs. I'll go find her. I get where you're coming from. Yeah, I don't know. I could be totally wrong. Uh, press dupe to pick up. Okay. Uh, you don't, I, I hmm. I would lower, I, okay. Oh, boy. Oh boy, it's interactive metronome again. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Men to keep have... an eye on your little sister. Mom is real worried about her. That's your job. You're the dad. I. Uh... It's okay, Dad. Ten years checking on her right now. You want to try raising a family like this? The devil himself would struggle with you guys. How is that good for anyone's psyche? Yeah. Uh. Mm -hmm. Uh, oh, f frustration is frustration. Okay, so I don't know how the fuck you move. Do you move? I... That, that would be great. I'd love to move. Oh, uh, how the fuck was I supposed to know that footprints would appear where I can click? Oh, that perspective change isn't disorienting at all. Okay, D all right, come, come here. I, I cannot. I can open. I cannot open. No, 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 no. Get your ass over here. No, go for... Dude, it's not that hard. Okay. Now, I, I cannot walk here. I can walk here. Okay. This is a thing. Examine the thing. Megan Clark. Number of days present, number of days absent, number of days tardy. Ooh. Where there's burbs, there's hope. Hey, Zerp. Ooh. Ah, that, those numbers. No, I wanted to see the back of that. No, 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 get your ass over here, you fucking... <sighs> These controls, man. Oh, those well, are... Megan is in even more trouble than I thought. E. Why 
Why does she have an E? That's not one of the choices. Maybe she's got a learning disability? I'm exploring. Anthony, where are you, goddammit? Anthony, I'm getting really pissed off. Okay, I guess Anthony, we're not exploring you anymore. Answer me. You could be right about my family. I think so too. Tanya! What's going on? Uh, that little brat locked back me then, out. maybe, it's maybe. Freezing. But it wasn't even one of the choices on the bottom of the though. I'll let you back in. Go easy on Megan. Don't Hold play on. with fire, kid. She's she is literally toying with fire. Oh, that's so... okay. What kind of floor is Shit. that flammable? Megan, you in there? Is linoleum? The kitchen's on fire! Like Are you fucking serious? Holy shit, that spread fast. Megan! I. Hmm. From what I know about fire science. I mean, maybe. <coughs> Mom! <coughs> Where the hell is everybody? Anthony! She locked her in. Help! Anthony! Hey! Up here! What the fuck are you doing up there? I got trapped in the attic. Get to the balcony! Anthony, help! Good God. Synthetics are that flammable? <laughs> Two to three minutes? Holy shit. I mean, I knew they could catch quickly, but that quickly is... is... Megan or Tanya? I mean, Tanya seems to be... A lot of death is from people thinking they have more time than they really do to escape. Yeah, I believe that. Tanya, I feel like, is in less danger. If the kid is in the flames... Ooh. I gotta do triage. I, uh, my gut is telling me to help Megan. Tanya, hold on! I gotta get Megan out! <laughs> Megan! Oh, kid. GG. Why 
why is nobody trying to call the fire department? Oh god. can you be? Oh my god. At least it was quick, maybe? I mean, I've seen this before, but, like, it's so old that it's kind of fresh now. might change the monster. I've never seen Tanya die that e either. Everyone always opts to save Tanya. I mean, I knew she was gonna die either way. Like, I know nobody survives that. But I, I wondered if this took a different course. If I tr at least tried to give the kids something to live for. <laughs> book dude the, the song is literally called a conversation with death I had no idea that we've met before, have we? No matter. Wh Welcome to my repository. How? I... Huh? So, this game can tell if I played the other games? Really? There's three versions and I like two of them. Which two do you like? Weird. The curator, the guardian of all these wonderful stories. And I have a very special tale for you to tell. Wait, so are they gonna be mean to me? The one that just played and the one from Until Dawn. Oh yeah, the one from Until Dawn is a banger. <laughs> Disconcerting, no? I'm sure there's nothing to worry about. <laughs> You're full of shit. This particular story isn't fully fleshed the Southern out. twangy mess, it's only yeah. Part written, nothing the like there's something wrong with Southern and twang, just... Mm. 
it's gotta fire. make sense. No, there was nothing you could have done about that. What's happened has happened. Or has it? <laughs> anyway, Hello, look to the trauma, future, I my say. old friend. Life's but a walking shadow, eh? You are about to enter a confusing, perhaps disturbing world. You are a walking how disturbing fire hazard. might depend on what you choose to believe. And how confusing on the path you choose to take. Everything in this room is made of water paper. <laughs> there are an infinite number of directions in which one could travel. We seldom have all the information that we'd like, but we have to choose our path. Wait, wait, wait. And hope that we get the clarity and the outcome. That leather that chair my dad had in his office once. That almost that exact As in leather. Life, your decisions will matter. With the buttons. The choices you make will affect others. You've seen how the story starts. So much. Yeah. Are you how many more of opening your eyes? Hopefully. You. It depends on the decisions that you make. What are you? Rational? Emotional? Do you trust your head or your heart? Why not both? There is no right answer. Sometimes one is best and sometimes the other. It's a library of the books are made of glass. That would be pretty odd. <laughs> to thine own self be true. But uh, <laughs> I'm here simply to record what you do, not to help you. <clears throat> I'm not supposed to interfere, you see. Hmm. Not my place, apparently. Good. Uh, but I am apparently allowed to share wise words uh, from great storytellers that have gone before. Where you I have a boss. Be appropriate. Oh, one final thing before I let you go. There are pictures in Little Hope that will, if found, show you a vision of a possible future. Kitty. Something that may or may not happen. Use them. They might help you. You have a funeral to attend. Off you go. Have fun. <laughs> Are you a sociopath? A good funeral? None of us here today can understand why this tragic accident happened. But we can take comfort from the knowledge that the family are together for eternity in God's loving embrace. That funeral I went to in Wisconsin where everyone was drinking and laughing was a banger. Okay, fair. There are some pretty nice funerals, but this doesn't seem like one of them. Honestly, at my funeral, I'd want to have people laughing and, and joking and having fun as well. I don't know. I just wouldn't want people to be sad. But I guess that's true to form. <laughs> Yo, Thunder Kitty. Andrew, 18. College student. Anxious detached. Wow, you learned how to type faster at the end there. Oh, hey, it's Clarice. Taylor, almost Tanya, 22. Do 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 do. Sorry, I saw the word headstrong. Rational overbearing. Where the hell's Daniel? I can't find him. I don't know. <sighs> Instead of goofing around, you want to lend a hand here? Uh, um, how's he doing? How is he doing anyway? Doesn't look that serious. Could be concussed. Okay, Professor. Or should I call you Doctor now? 
Oh my Why god. Why don't you try calling for help? Maybe the cops, someone like that. Maybe they don't understand bodies in the floor. Damn, Dale. Uh, compliant. I already tried once, but I'm on it. There's no reason to be back talking right now. Hey, Andrew, buddy. How you doing? Where are we? What happened? Yeah, the bus crashed. We're okay, though. Just shaking up. If you say so. I don't remember being in any crash. Dude, you don't you're, you're remember probably much. in shock. Maybe a mild concussion in there too. Give yourself some time. Stay here. Don't move. <clears throat> oh. <gasps> Fucking thing uses pizza. Andrew crap. looks like person who would be suspect number one. Be dead. Okay, Hold take it. it easy. We'll figure out what to do. Oh yeah. You were ejected. Damn, Daniel. College student. Amiable and defensive. Oh, where's my phone? I don't know what those two things. I guess they could go together. Oh, here's a flashlight. Angela, 48, mature student, abrasive, understanding. Uh, I guess those hey, two things go together. Anyone up there? Hey, Daniel, that you? John, good to hear you. Daniel? Taylor, you okay? I'm good. We're fine too, thanks for asking. You okay down there? I'm all right, nothing I can't deal with. Hey, John. Any idea what caused the crash? Not sure. Looked like the driver swerved to avoid something in the road. He down there, by the way? Nope. No sign of him. Weird. He isn't up here either. Can you get back they up didn't to search us? search down there for them? Looks pretty I steep. guess not. I see a trail down here I could try. Great. Take the trail. Should take you to the road. We can regroup there. That's a plan. See you soon. Hey, Taylor, help me get Andrew up on his feet, will ya? Wait, I don't remember anything. Who are you? It's okay. You're concussed. I'm John, you're a college professor. <coughs> we were taking a bus on a field trip, but that didn't work out so well. Crash wasn't on the curriculum. <laughs> uh, we'll find the others, get some help. Think of it as a character building exercise. Uh, oh god, hi. <sighs> Teamwork at its finest. I had this dream. It was so real. Flames all around us. It was grim. That bang on the head must have been a beauty. That trail the others are on will come out down the road. Yeah, it's called we'll trauma. Meet them there. Uh, why would we leave the bus? We should talk this through. Why leave the bus? Not like we have somewhere better to wait. No. We could be here all night. Our best move is to get to the others, then head towards town. See if we can find some help. Um, alright, but where's the bus driver? Where's the driver? Shouldn't he be back by now? The driver's done what we should be doing. Gone into town for help. Uh... I'm not gonna say anything. Okay. Wait here all night, then. Indecisive about Tom. Okay. Indecisive is not terrible. Girl stood in the road. Okay. I'll go myself. Hey, professor! He is a professor, right? I'm still fuzzy. Can we we didn't together? search for the bus driver Wait, very long. Is the only thing. Right. We should all stick together. I got no signal either. Must be some kind of black spot. Or you didn't pay your last bill. You get that during the crash? <sighs> Guess so. Oh, weird. That's not how she died, though. Uncertain is locked in. Jesus, I make one decision and. What crawled up the professor's ass? God, the frames. I think you should show him a little more respect. 
the frames are just not hold on hold on hold on hold on hold on right like what i don't know all right graphics i think i need to aa quality uh let's go medium let's go medium limit frame rate to 30 fps i don't know about that v-sync off let's go to medium let's go back am i sure i want to save yeah display fine hdr that's fine let's see if that helps think she's smarter than us but book smart is no good out here oh Salt no up himself acting like the big man on campus okay okay kid okay oh boy you are a staticky fucking mess you yeah 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 you don't want to okay go over here why are you so laggy inspect welcome to little hope abandoned hope unreadable really Okay. You know this place? Little Hope? No. I mean, I don't think so. You should both know Little Hope. Um, why? Well, why should I have heard of this place? Seriously, this place is steeped in history. Fascinating stuff. Uh, I don't think we need to make small talk right now <sighs> history for you two is remembering the last burger you ate bruh we're on a fucking mission i i don't think i need to be knowing like sir white pants the third fucked little lady fingers the 18th and Good they founded the too. town i don't Finally. give a fuck everything okay sure we took the scenic route you sure as hell took your own sweet time i was getting worried i bet you were this gate is chained we can't get through mm. look around see if there's anything we can use to break it what was that arm touch? Think this'll do it. Ready? I'll push hard from my side. Ready. Three, two, one. Push. Uh, okay. I guess we don't get any frames for this. Are we frozen? Hello? Oh, fuck. Have I angered the game gods? Hello? Oh, maybe there's an autosave. I think I... I don't know what I did. Alright, hold on. I'm gonna crash this game for a second. Because Lord knows it's... 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 I think she's frozen. Hey. Do you mind? Would you like to close? the fuck is wrong with you all right well task manager i didn't want to do this yeah little hope is not responding yeah no fucking shit all right there we go 
do 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 Every time I see the word headstrong, that song gets stuck in my head. I know it's like an old meme, but like... Headstrong will take you on. Headstrong will da da you on. We gotta do the shift tab nonsense again. Wait, did everything die? Am I still alive? I didn't even think to check. We can hear me? Okay. Yeah, it looks like the game just decided fuck you in particular. All right, this this is fine. You should give me the option to continue. <sighs> History for you two is remembering the last burger you ate. Oh, fuck off, yeah. Okay, already less laggy. Good to see you two, finally. Everything okay? Sure. We took the scenic route. You sure as hell took your own sweet time. I was getting worried. I bet you were. What's this gate is chained. We can't get through. Look around, see if there's anything we can use to break it. Also, what class is this? Think this'll do it? Ready? I'll push hard from my side. Ready. Three, two, one, push. <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Great job, you two. Okay, cool. We didn't bug the game this time. What's the plan now? I already said I want to wait at the bus for help. College will be. I know college, like but which course? And we've already concluded this conversation. Not with everyone here, we didn't. We should vote on it. No need for a vote. Decisions made. Angela's an old student. Well, yeah, but... Ah, uh, no. I think we should keep our mouths shut. I'm sorry, but Both we really don't have time to be suck. arguing. You'll stay here with me, won't you? She is an old student, uh, but like... Looks like he ain't so keen after all. You don't you have to be an asshole out. if John's you're... right. Heading into town is our quickest way to find help. Uh, what is this? Satisfied? Sure. Whatever you say. Okay, okay. Try okay. to be civil. Hold on. So, I went to college. <laughs> you sure did, Wolfie. Yeah, so I went to college. I was in college for bio, and most of us were young. But there were some, like, older students. I would place the maybe 40s, 50s, maybe a couple of them were even in their 60s um who were in the classes but those old students were like usually super nice like they could be a little rough around the edges um and like but usually they were like super nice and a little bit like self-conscious and and they tried to be really helpful I don't know. It could have been just the the culture. 
That being said, the, the college where I took my biology classes was brutal. Apparently, it, it was harder than a lot of biology departments and other colleges. Hopefully, I think you're forgetting that not everyone is the same. Yeah, that's true, but I don't think, like, it's a trope that they're nasty. I mean, I'm sure some of them are. I'm sure some of them are, but, like... I'm sure, I'm sure some of them are nasty, but, like... Just because she's an old student doesn't necessarily mean she's gotta be, like... Caddy. Costs nothing. That's rich, given how you badmouth Taylor on the way over. What did she say about me? Why is this you old student get getting in... Stick up for you? Try doing it yourself sometime, dear. Why are you in drama? You're old. Uh, I don't think... I don't think saying anything is gonna... Well, that certainly shut you up. <sighs> Quit it, will you? The last thing we need is you causing trouble. Keep out of our business, okay? We are wasting valuable time We're here. We're picking we this up in the middle of moving? everyone's relationship, so maybe they I'm haven't liked each other for a while. That is true. That's a great idea. I'm going to hang out by the bus while you all do whatever you have to. Why are you, you going? You want to come along here? and wait with me? Okay. Uh, what? I thought you were. I still think the smart move is for us all to stick together. You'll be glad we didn't stick together after we flagged down a car and come rescue your ass. What? I. Hmm. You get lost? No. Back here? This doesn't add up. This is some very weird shit going on here. Spare us all. First he loses his pride, then he loses his way. What are you trying to say? That you've lost it. What? It's not possible. Look, I don't know what you're trying to prove here, but we've got better things to do. Daniel? Whoa. Hey, careful. Watch out. Quit fucking around and tell me what's going on here. The two You're of us will go together. This is getting ridiculous. Indulge me. What? what? I walked away from you! We're trapped here! There's no way out! I, I don't understand! She's right. We walked dead straight going away from you. So, how'd we end up back here? Hmm. Okay, let's try something. We'll all go together. We came from that direction. We must be able to go back that way. I want everyone to stay real close. No stragglers. You want to put us on a kid's line? Oh. Okay, okay, I'm coming. What course does this guy teach? I don't know why it's bugging me. There's no bus here. I admit that is a little odd. A little? More than a little. See? What did I tell you? It's just like I've been saying, we are trapped. We can't leave here. Now okay, do do? calm down, breathe. There's a rational explanation for what's happening. Maybe we all died in the crash. What's with the weird yeah, echo effect? Nice theory, but I'm pretty sure we're all still alive and kicking. <laughs> Last I checked, you were schooling us on creative writing, not metaphysics. Oh, I know who creative I'd like writing. Kicking. This is all down to you, this pissy little field trip. What? Now what? we're stuck here in little no hope. That what? is way out of uh, line. Huh? I had no way of knowing that damn bus would crash. You can't put that on me. Why are you she jumping like real? this? Watch your tone, will you? I am doing my best to understand this, just like you and the rest of us. What? I did apologize. What the I'm fuck sorry. are you on about? I don't get what's happening to us. I don't understand. It's like you said, we're trapped in a nightmare. It's okay. We're gonna be just fine. We'll figure a way out of this together. Someone else thinks they can do a better job? Step right up. Maybe it isn't real. 
We have to get out of here right I need to think straight. Right now. Of all coaching. Why the fuck? Can everyone just shut up? This isn't helping us find help or getting us out of here. He's right. Bitching at each other isn't getting us anywhere. We have to work together as a team. Thank you. Now let's mm. be logical. The fog is between us and the bus. There is no fog between us and town, so let's head that way. I don't get how heading further away from the bus helps. I don't understand why you think there the bus is helps. nothing on the bus we can use to get help. In town, there will be people, a working phone, something. It pains me to admit, but he's right. There is nowhere else we can go except into that damn town. Sounds like a plan to me. You leaving me? Where are you going? Come on, let's go with them. Until we know what's up, we should stick together. Why do you want to go back to the bus so bad? How'd you get that bruise? <sighs> no biggie. Must have got it when the bus crashed. What's this way, though? I am immediately disobeying directions, which is not good. But... I don't feel very smart because I don't know how to get back to where we were. Okay, there we go. Cool, so we know about a gun. That's pretty neat. Why did you say we might all be dead? You really think that's possible? I saw some cable show about how your brain keeps going for a while after you... You know. You die? Forget about it. What they said didn't really stack up. Oh, a real kitty. I don't like the look of that place at all. Oh. Maybe they won't ask for ID. A fucking... I'm not sure this is such a great idea. We should check it out. There could be a phone inside. I'll go in and take a look around. Go ahead. We'll be right behind you. My question is, why would you need to go to a field trip why for a creative writing guys? course? Angela knows there's something between us. That's obvious. We're really going to get into this now? Like we've got no other bigger shit to deal with tonight? Yeah, this really? is a big deal. For me, anyhow. I'm what? telling you, Angela is onto us. She knows. Why does that pro why is that an issue? Why, what why? did you two talk about? She was digging around like she always does. Uh, okay. What did you tell what her? What exactly did you tell her back there? Relax. I said nothing about us. Okay. I'm not ready to go public about us yet. I will be soon, I promise. Why does that matter? Anything I can do to help convince you I'm the right guy? What? Why is this happening now? I need to know 100% I can rely on you. That you'll never let me down. Uh, we should catch up with the others. They're also like 10 we feet away from here all night, or are we going inside? Uh, okay. Hmm. Okay, to be fair, Clarice is setting herself up hard to avoid drama with.
Hi there. How you doing? Excuse me, but we're uh, looking for our bus driver. What? Have you seen him? <laughs> yeah, that's funny. What is? What's up with the fog outside? It's pretty weird. Yeah, it sure is a thick one tonight. So thick it's stopping us from leaving. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I know that feeling. You mean you're trapped uh, sorry here too? Sorry for busting in like this. Uh, bus we were on crashed a little way back up the road there. We're still a little shaken up. We're still a lot shaken up. You certainly look shook up. I'm Vince. I need a mirror. Maybe there's one here not covered in 20 years. Of Sounds like you could use a drink. Better Why not, do you thanks. Need, a mirror? You need to keep a clear head. <clears throat> it's right there if you change your mind. No. Not for me. Why are you even here? Little Hope sure isn't the town it used to be. Uh, what happened here? What happened here? The place seems completely deserted. Little Hope feels a little like a ghost town. And that fog? Life moves on, you know. But we don't all go with it. Uh, is there... Why are you still here? Why are you still here? Yeah, if the place is as dead as you say, what are you still doing here? I come and go. You know how it is? Mm hmm Anyway, I can't help you. What is this guy's problem? There's definitely something off about him. <laughs> uh, he's harmless. Just had one too many. Let's look around. There must be something here that can help us. Why is she playing See darts? See what you can dig up. Uh. He's in a world of his own. <laughs> An old darts board. I was pretty good back in the day. Stay. Play a little. No problem. I'm going to take a look around. Everyone's <clears throat> dynamic is so weird. We need an umbilical, cord. <clears throat> umbilical cord for that thing? Looking for a way out. What are you Just a quick throw. Then we'll figure out how we're getting out of here. Try for a big double. Or... Not my first time, Daniel. Shooting for double 20. Uh, use Zung to aim. Okay, so you can play a little. Still got it. Now for triple 20. Oh, I have to get my... Well, almost an Olympic shot after the night we've had. They don't play darts in the Olympics. They should. <laughs> that is one hell of a shot. <laughs> you did better than Taylor. Let's get back to why we came in here. I'm now curious. Talk to Vince or search the bar. I cannot go there. Let's examine it. Uh, no, you're in dial tone. Fuck. Uh, uh, can you go in here? The, 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 it's a door. Uh, okay. Uh, I guess I'll talk to. No, come here. Kid. <laughs> Got anything else for us on Little Hope? Uh, booze gone in my head. You alright? 
You okay? I'm sure it's just one too many. We both had better days. Uh, say nothing. Uh, are you not going to let me? Okay. A little hope is all but gone now. Only thing here now is ghosts from the past. Hmm. Traits updated? Okay. Done. The, whoa, hey. Dismissive. I'm locked into dismissive? How did I get locked into dismissive? Okay. Introduce himself as Vince. Refuse to offer from the drink. Okay. Okay. Uh, I guess we can continue to search things. Come. Wait, no, 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 there was shit that way. What? Huh? Okay, examine. It's a bunch of numbers. No, I wanted to see the back of that. <laughs> These controls, I know they shouldn't be hard. This Red place person. has some great history. Hope Town Hall. Signs to watch for and how these things are left hand path to delinquency and Satanism. Grab a snack and use the bathroom? Not a problem. I mean, Satanism isn't that bad. Uh, let's see. I, I, wait, that was never, never, never. Disincorporation. I vaguely remember what happened here. All the factories closed down. Wolf Hope Town. Mass exodus and empty coffers. Appointed as an emergency manager to administer public services. Remaining residents. Last of the remaining townsfolk are planning to leave. I'd love if you would stop flapping. We're faced with no option but just incorporate. Okay, basically we got the gist. Yeah, some great history indeed. This place is history. Oh, I, I know about this. Okay, so... Let's head that way. Examine you. January 6th, 1970. <laughs> Grab the thingy. Do the flip. I can't believe it. These guys could be relatives. Hmm. This place is definitely seen hey, better days. This way. Let's get out of here and. You all hear that? I definitely heard something. Did you hear that as well? Come on. Whatever it was came from outside. Really think it's smart to go back outside? Well, there's nothing for us here. We need to move on. Best of luck. Hope you find what you're looking for.
black cat bar. Oh, that's kind of cute. It's coming from the town. Did the old fucker just lock us out? He was weird, that old guy. Sure was something off about him. I don't blame him. I come to Creepy Central just to get a top up. What does that mean? Heading into Little Hope feels like our only option. I'm not so sure about that. Where else can we go? Do, 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 do. I have a bad feeling about this. We'll figure it out. The way this fog just appears. It's not natural. It's not shit. Oh, hey. There's a thing. No, let me see the thing. Uh, you wanna... The... It looks like a thing. What the hell is this thing? Looks like some kind of effigy. A warning, perhaps. Or some other spiritual significance. Whatever it is, it gives me the creeps. I don't know. I'm kind of curious about it. I've heard more than enough, thank you. Oh, there's a kid running around. Uh... Let's be nice. I'm sorry, I didn't scare you, did I? I don't know which is scarier. Whatever this is, or your morbid interest in it. Uh, let's be... I'm not superstitious, but stuff like what happened to us with the fog. That's polite. Let's uh, catch up with the rest. I don't want to spend any more time with this disgusting thing. Oh. What? I don't understand these things. Our kids doing at ass o'clock at night on some random street. Their bus crashed. Ugh. I I don't understand the bearings. I don't understand much. Navigate. Navigate the palm of my hand, bitch. Uh, I don't know. Oh, I mean the background kid? Oh, anyone's guess. The bearing updated. What? What? Andrew, insecure. Oh, this is what you mean. Fearful. Oh, good. How are we already having locked traits? Yo ni ponima yo. Ah. Can you two make an effort to keep up? Oh, shut your pie hole, yeah. Uh, what is this camera angle? Where the fuck am I supposed to be going? <laughs> ah, yeah. Would you mind to keep walking, yeah? Am I even going in the right direction? Uh, no, apparently. Oh, I have no fucking clue. I don't see a goddamn thing. Am I even going in the right direction? Here's a place. No, don't then turn around. I, okay. Hey, can you come over here? What's wrong? I just saw someone in the woods. I can't see anyone. 
Uh, I definitely saw someone. I definitely saw someone. 100%. Sorry, I don't buy it. Nobody would be out here at this ungodly hour. I've returned with snacks and popcorn. Nice. Oh, let's find the others. Okay. We really should catch up with the others. You two. We need to stick close. Excuse me. Very good. We're freaked. Who's there? Whoever you are, this isn't funny at all. John, where are you? Daniel? Taylor? Come on, John, where are you? This isn't funny. Get back on the road, maybe. Oh. Still fucking fearful. Oh. We don't have a relationship. Cool. We don't have a relationship. Cool. Okay. Why are we locked? You and uh, I, I don't understand anything. I don't understand anything. All right, let's. Let's go to the. Hey, wait for us. Oh, that's always a fantastic sign. What is that? Hey. Come and check this out. What on earth is that? Not a clue. Mm. 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 -mm. That is, uh, that's unfortunate. <laughs> what is your name, sir? Uh, I'm Andrew. I'm um, Andrew? Andrew? And your name, lady? Who the hell are you? Why are you dressed like that? I am called Mary. I fashioned her with my own hand. Why'd you put her? She looks just like the one beside her. you. Would you kindly come play with me? Come play. Come play with what me. What witch's trickery is this now, Mary? I have done nothing. Hold your tongue. That's the Reverend Carver's affection for you will be shaken loose when he learns of your infidelity with the devil. Affection? The fuck? Amen. Amen. Come back here. There you are. There's someone else out here. I, by the fire. I, what? I, I, I don't see any fire. I saw them too. Are you okay? Uh. This place is all fucked up. This place up. is all wrong. Whatever happened here, it's over now. You have no clue. You didn't see what we saw. I don't get it. What exactly happened here? Uh, a little girl appeared. This young girl came out of the fog. Spoke to us. Maybe the fog has got you confused. We're all stressed out. Stressed my ass. I saw a girl dancing right here, clear as day. Said her name was Mary. 
looked exactly like the girl in my dream, but she talked in this really weird accent. Was that even American? I'm not sure. I couldn't American? place her accent either. What have we gotten ourselves into? This kid, Mary, did she want to hurt you? Uh, I don't think she meant harm. No. I don't think she meant to hurt me. Now what? Seems our only option is the road into town. You're kidding me. Got a better idea? Thought not. Why does she not want to go into town? I don't understand why people are so invested in one direction or another. You've no idea where the fuck you are. Is it just like some stand-in for like a power play? Escalated rather quickly. Everything that one does or doesn't do in one's life will catch up with one eventually. Don't you think? Mm -hmm. Don't look at me. I can't help you. Remember? What the? What is with that weird emphasis? We sometimes congratulate ourselves on waking from a troubled dream. It may be so the moment. After death. I have not tried Valorant. On my travels over many years, I've witnessed many things, seen and heard many beliefs, and there's usually some element of truth in each of them. These unfortunate folk seem to be dealing with forces as yet unexplained. I mean, sinister movements in the forest, Spirits from the past, the little girl who may be in trouble. Or maybe she simply is trouble. Mm. Anyway, where are we? Mm. Angela isn't getting much tittle tattle out of Taylor. <laughs> no kiss and tell. What about John? The figure of authority, perhaps. Or perhaps. He represents something else. And then there's Andrew. Somewhat confused, I think. A bump to the head can do that. Let me reassure you. You help make some decisions that will be valued later on. And some that may turn out to be... regrettable. That fellow in the bar. He was less than helpful, more than a little rude, if you ask me. I didn't ask. Clearly something disturbing on his mind. Enough. There's something not quite right in Little Hope. And souls may be in peril. Off you go again. See if you can lift the fog. Find the bus driver. Why the fuck are you so intense about that? Anyway, did you know that unlike humans, where XY is males and XX is females, it is actually female birds who have two different oh sex gosh, chromosomes. She sounded so strange. I could barely understand. Um, and males that have two of the same. And as a result, in some birds, the older females get, their secondary sex characteristics start to fade, so older females start looking more like males. She sure sounded like she wasn't from anywhere around here. I'm tempted to say she sounded more like she was from another time than another place. You're right. I'm now Angela. Interesting. Right? Uh, let's check out this car. There might something be here. Oh, would you look at that? It does have a shield, no, no, it's a Wow, eh? No, you sealed it. So, oh. Hmm.
Unless we're the ones that got the gene now wrong about males and females. No, sometimes, sometimes things are just different, um, with determining sex and, um, and animals. Some animals, their, whether or not they're male or female isn't even determined by their chromosomes. In fact, with turtles, uh, whether or not you were born male or female, like, is determined on how warm or cold the place was where your egg was laid. Which is why global warming is fucking up the uh, male to female ratio in some turtles. Ah yes, the scariest of deer. Might get a better view from up there. Okay. Mm. I know I'm supposed to follow you, but I am genuinely curious about this direction. Uh, there appears to be fuck all. Oh, wait, what? What's this? The same area the deer ran into, buddy? Yeah, no. It doesn't seem like the most, uh... I know I'm supposed to go this way, motherfucker. There are picnic tables here. There's a thing to exit. Oh, here it is. Ghost towns of the northeast. Little hope. The town returning to nature. Abiding image of ghost town. Reasons the town gets very blah blah blah. Hidden depths. Da 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 da. Places abandoned. Yada yada yada. Okay. I mean, I see no reason we can't just keep walking. Oh, they're there. Literally, they just had that redirect so I could read that newspaper? What? That way, whoa, 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 hey, I see the thing. Give me thing. Little Hope Historical Society, The Witch of Edmonton, Bill Riley, Decker, and John Ford performed in historical dress. Hmm. Could this have something to do with what we saw? Uh, it could be. I guess it could didn't feel like that. I don't know which is worse. Ghostly apparitions or a town full of historical weirdos. I mean, fair. I'm pretty sure we're supposed to be going this way. Are we going the wrong way? What? Why are y'all just standing here? Do you mind? Would would you like to would you like to do the thing? <sighs> no, I don't think 
like I'm seeing too much on the periphery, but I'm checking nevertheless. Oh, hello. Uh, yeah, come here, I guess. No, okay, well, bye. Let's see here. It seems like it would be something. It's not. Okay, cool. Oh boy. It's it's that bridge. Hold on. Never mind. Cutscene. There's time. something up ahead. Uh, you might want to get out of the road. Which way? Can we move it? Move what? Amen to that. Look at that. Hey, wait. Stop! What, what, why do we care? I'm just gonna say it. This is exactly what goes down in horror movies. Um. What the hell do we do now? Just keep moving. I'll deal with this. Stay right here. Uh, deal with what? It's a. supportive. Hold up, I'll come with you. There's no reason to have stuff. Hey, you two! <gasps> this is not good. Confront, R really? and the older teachers to check on the possible bomb threats. This is like that a little bit. Why is it you want from that? Uh, who are you? Who are you? What are you doing here? These are most troubling times. Wait, don't go. Stay away. Full of riddles. I will not succumb to a witch's spell. Please, Lord, I beg you, rid me of these apparitions. Who are you? This can't be happening. Fix your gaze elsewhere. You are no husband of mine. Fix your gaze elsewhere. You are no husband of mine. Let's get into town. It's not so far now, and it's our best shot at getting help. Hmm. You guys okay? Uh, I think I saw my own tumble. I am very far from okay. I am terrified and confused. I just saw my own double in the fog. What happened in there? This woman came out of nowhere in the fog, dressed like an extra from Salem. She was harboring <laughs> something in an accent I didn't recognize. And most disturbing of all, I like she her. was a spitting image of me. How is that even possible? You're blowing this out of proportion, Angela. I am all done here. 
Seems the fog won't let us go anywhere except into the center of town. The fog decides where we can and can't go? Fuck that. I'm trying another way. Don't you kids watch horror movies? You never ever split up. Those movies are dumb. And I'm going this way without you. Maybe splitting up isn't such a good idea, Taylor. No way am I going down there. <sighs> I'm with John. Oof. I'm with Andrew. I'm with Andrew. The town isn't so far. We all go in together. Let out, Granny. No one asked you. Okay, <sighs> time out. Can we all just take a breath? Think about what our next move is. We can check out more options. Hi, Taylor. To split up. Yeah. I'll go with Taylor. It's not safe for you to be hanging around here on your own. Two teams are more likely to find a way out, which is what we all want, right? I guess you're right. If the fog lets you through and you find help, send them into town to find us. I don't understand why Taylor is being. Got a feeling we'll find help faster than the others. As long as somebody does, that's all that matters. I don't. I, Taylor, I'm not. I don't understand Taylor's motivations. Is the problem. Like, I don't understand why she's so. Da -na -na -da -na 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 -da, headstrong about the direction we're going. It feels obvious that it would be better to be together so that there are more people to help. You hear that? <laughs> Excuse me? Oh god, we're doing things. Uh, no, no, hey! Sorry about that. Are we okay here? We're good. Uh, somewhere around here, there must be an easier way back up to the road. Let's move out. Uh, sorry, Angela. You got an explanation for what we saw? Nothing that makes sense. I do know... There were witch trials in Little Hope around the same time as Salem. What happened? You can figure that out for yourself. What? I, I, oh, Mr. History Buff, you're what not gonna... What the hell gonna... was that? Now what? Ah, uh, yo, 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 there was an inspecty thing. Cody time to be a woman. Yeah. Uh, okay. I think I learned pretty much everything I was gonna learn about that. Oh, that looks painful. That, that looks, uh, hey, we should, uh, should fuck out of there. Oh, during Salem? Yeah. Um, I'm like 80% Oh, That was a talk thing. Are you okay? Feels like Angela is constantly weighing me up and finding me lacking. I feel responsible for everyone here. You are all in my care. Oh, I've got a message. How would you handle all this in my position? Uh, let's stay positive. I guess I'd try to stay positive. Do my best, that's all anyone could do. Not sure my best is up to dealing with whatever is going on around us tonight. What we saw back there. You think that was really supernatural? Uh, we can't be sure. We really can't be sure what it is we've seen. Huh? Makes sense to me. Just because I can't explain what we saw doesn't mean we have to reach the most extreme conclusion. 
That's kind of what happened in Little Hope during the witch trials. They made bad decisions based on very little hard evidence. Um, okay. I get that. Sure. I get that. Either way, our goal here is not the reason why we didn't stay with disproving the, bus. the supernatural ghosts, uh, whatever else. It's because the professor didn't the want to here. for strong reasons. I don't like the sound of that. He was like, we're more likely to get help if we go into town. And Taylor was like, nah, fuck you. does not seem like a great idea. Fuck. Wait! What was this about jumping to conclude? Oh boy. What is it? What's wrong? We saw something moving in there. What exactly are you up to? I'm just taking a look here. Isn't this breaking and entering? It was I won't tell if you don't. Anyhow, there's no one here. Uh, modern magic and ritual. I would like to open book. New Age curses. You unstep three steps in the perfection of your character. Alright, whatever. Uh breaking and entering. Yeah. Practical magician, sun, moon, death, and rebirth. Moon represents the divine goddess, queen of heaven. Oh god, this is some wicked shit. Identify the Messiah. Represent cosmic balance, male and female. Yeah, okay. Yeah, here we go, wicked. Uh, I. You can you can ask me privately why I go uh, but. I. I I have my biases. I'm, I'm, I'm entitled to them. Uh, if if you're gonna do it, if you're gonna do it, do it. Oh, just open it. Nah. Ah. No. I think that's not a good idea. We know that it's there. I I don't think we need it in case we use it against each other unwittingly. Uh hey, you wanna you wanna keep going? It's a stick figure. What kind of place is this? A place that likes stick figures.
professor? I'll play it a little longer, but I am getting tired. And I, I'll definitely continue it tomorrow. I will finish it, Sassy. Professor, <gasps> homeboy's over there. There you are. Uh, that was crazy. That was crazy back there. Sorry I took off like that. I'm more twitchy than I thought. Thanks for coming after me. What the hell was that in there? Good question. Uh, don't worry about it. It was nothing. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it? What? What am I? In second grade? He's right. Get over yourself and move on. I, I, we saw a cat. Why is that so hard to articulate? This place is our best shot. There must be a radio or a working phone inside. Maybe even our driver too. Oh my god, the communication skills. Look around for something we can so break the glass bad. with. <laughs> Didn't even realize it was getting that late. Me neither. This it's it's a fun game. Oh. Da 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 I've just got headstrong stuck in my fucking head. I'm I must be the most annoying little shit to watch slash listen to. Take the card. Flip it over. Hmm. That don't look good. This must be... Can I save? Will it just pick me up at a checkpoint? I don't... I don't know. Alright. Uh, return to main menu. We should have a continue bit. <laughs> but yeah, this is fun. But yeah, a few things. Thing one. A lot of the problems are because the they're, they're not communicating. And they get fixated on things. Like, there's so much ego going on. It's interesting. I guess all of the Until Dawn stories are like that. Because in Man and Vin... Actually, not so much in... Well, a little bit in Man and Madan. You had, um... Conrad, whose ego kept fucking everything up. Yeah, no, and the girl. And the guy. Definitely in House of Ashes, ego is dicking everything up. As an introvert, communication is hard. This is true. The characters are frustrating. The characters being frustrating are part of why these games are fun. Because it gives me something to talk about. I mean, communication is hard. Is there... And I'm an introvert too. I hate dealing with people. Unless I really like those people, I don't... I don't... <laughs> Vulture has the saying, It's time to stop making friends. Um, and it's always time to stop making friends. Um, but... Zerp, when you communicate, you communicate directly. <laughs> like, if... Okay, okay. So if you're going into, like, a little shack or whatever... 
and you know there's something moving and it's kind of sinister and you're like oh what is that and like you go and you check it out and it's a cat what are you gonna tell me Hopefully, you're going to tell me it's a cat. <laughs> and that it's totally fine. Like, communication is hard, but it's not that hard. <laughs> but I'm being nitpicky. Um, but yeah. Uh, I am going to chill out in the secret server. Uh, while the VOD downloads. After I get a drink of water and a snack. In the meantime, there was a four-legged beastie. There was a four-legged beastie in the cabin. It had fur and bright eyes. It did. I thought he was done for. I thought he was done for. And terrible flashing teeth in a tiny little mouth. And fluffy fur and a wagon tail and it was playing with a ball of yarn. I thought he was gonna die. <laughs> it tried to curse me with its mew. That'll do. Um, next week, though, uh, if you are not subscribed to Auxi at Chiro's The Real, subscribed. This is not YouTube. If you're not following her, you you might want to do that because. There's a little secret thing going on over there. And, uh... A little birdie... A little birdie told me that something might be happening on Saturday. That you might want to listen to. But you didn't hear this from me. Uh... Yeah, I'll, I'll, uh, hold on, there we go, Chia Rose the Real, go find that. Yes, it is the wee little ghosty. Uh, and there may or may not be cheese involved. But you didn't hear it from me. Wink. In the meantime, do not eat or drink any questionable substances. Make smart decisions to not die. Dying is absolutely forbidden, and I'll see all of you wonderful people at a later time. Uh, we may do a little more Little Hope tomorrow. We might do near. It depends. Yes, cheese. And that is all I'm allowed to say. Definitely give her a follow. Thanks for streaming with us. Bruh, thanks for being here, dog. Like, you guys are awesome. You guys make time so much easier to spend. Um... And yeah, so Sassy suggested we do Little Hope. If there's other games kind of like this you guys want me to try my hand at, I'll see if I can get a a uh, hand on them. But let's trudge through Little Hope for now, and we'll we'll get back to Near soon. I know that I put Near on hold for a minute. Inscription has taken over my life. It's, it's 
bad. Uh, I'll probably be playing more Inscription tonight. Those of you people who know where to find me, you know where to find me. All right, take care, guys. <laughs> Goodbye! Mm.